So there really is no way I can beat you. I mean, you can, you, I mean, you even be my unbeatable brother. And if it isn't the two of you again, I was wondering what all the noise was about. And if it isn't Sonya, congratulations on beating Leon. Taking it in all the stride like it's your due, eh? You cheeky sing. So what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be off assisting the professor? Hop, I'm actually not working as my grand assistant any longer. In fact, I'm the professor now. Alright. In real, I've got the two of you to sing for that. I was just along for the ride on your adventure, but I am just taking a real interest in the history of the Galar region. I came to care for Pokemon even more than I ever had before. Alright. And here. It's a book I wrote. I even signed it, so that makes it a collective item. Okay. I've already got my own copy. Lined up to buy it on the day it came out. Anyways, I've got my grand's blessing then put out my first book under my own name. I think you can expect great things of the lovely Professor Sonya in the future, wouldn't you say? I expect so. Sonya makes you both amaze me. I've got a lot to live up to here. So what are you youngins doing here? Oh, that's it, isn't it? You're putting the rusted sword and shield back in their place. Okay, you forgot entirely, didn't you? What, do you think the two of you are besties now with Sasuke and Dama Denter or something? Well, that's gonna happen. That must be it. Why do you feel like you were called here? Okay. Let's put it back. And then after this, the plot can progress. Took us a little while, but we brought back your precious relics and all. Okay. That about settled that. Why don't you and I head back? What are you going to do, Sonian? I think I'll stay here a bit longer. I want to do a little more research here in the forest. My power spot detector is going off. And here comes the least interesting characters in this whole game. Well, I thought I heard someone making some noise over this way. Well, well, well. You wouldn't be the Professor Sonya who wrote the book, Galar, A History. Why, yes, of course. I read it from cover to cover. I even wrote an internet review for it. That book was filled with lies, so we gave it one star. There's no lies printed in that book. That's just plain rude. I am Swordward, and I'm Shieldbert. We are the new kings of Galar. We are descendants of the first kings. Okay. More than that, we are celebrities. Seriously, what are you on about? What exactly are you two supposed to be? Pretty irrelevant to the plot. Well, could these things here be the Fable Sword and Shield? They certainly are dirty, they must be fake. I fear to touch them with my bare hands. Alright. Oh, do shut up. We only happened to pick up some things that were dropped on the ground. If you got a problem with it, how about you prove whom they belong to? But there's no way anyone can prove those ancient who those ancient things belong to. Even if we can't prove it, they're really important to Zacian and Gamba Zenta. Oh goodness, such a plebeian. And yet so pushy. 
If it's really so important to you, perhaps we should settle this with a battle. We're celebrities who buy battles for twice what they're worth. So what does that even mean? I, the Magnificent Shilbert, am your opponent. They're so unimportant, even the, um... They're so unimportant, even the game just acknowledges them as regular trainers. But hey, I guess this game needed a villain, and these two apparently were the cut for it. But even then, it doesn't matter, because, um... They're not even that interesting. Not even that interesting to the plot. And they only and they don't even show up to the post game. Which is kind of sad. It makes their role kind of sad. Time to end this. Oh. Okay. Let's use Psychic. Clang. All right, Chandelure. Oh, and he's got one more left after this. Okay. Time to end this one. Bronzong. Alright. Oh, everything can kill you. I guess I'll use Shadow Ball. Did he just die temporarily? Okay. So somehow have defeated with to somehow have defeated the adorable Pokemon I goes forward with. You're certainly strong. However, it appears my older brother was victorious. All right. Younger brother, isn't that the one who stopped Eternatus? Now look closely, I believe it is. What a rude child snatching up our chance at glory like that. According to our sources, I believe he was also present during the destruction of the magnificent mural of our ancestors. So artfully created many years ago. You mean that little drawing beat destroyed? I had nothing to do with that. Now, if you want to, if you want 
to if you want someone to talk to, go to Bolunia. You'll find your um, you'll find the culprit. What a garish brew. Destroying the moral of our family has held in such high esteem for so long. You mean the one that hid the historical ruins of Damadenta and the other? And hold on a moment, Blitz wasn't the one who destroyed it. Let us withdraw for now. Next time we shall bring Pokemon that will utterly defeat you. And with that, farewell. That kid, he's gone and recklessly rung it off. At least you're calm, but I expected as much. I'm surprised that Hop lost to someone like that. He looked so upset about something during the battle. Maybe that had something to do with it? He's probably still going through character development. His own rival became the new champion, and his goal vanished before his eyes. You can't help but wonder how he feels about it all. Anyway, forward and show, but was it? I think I might know something about where those two weirdos went. Shall we go over it at, at the lab in Wedgehurst? Alright. Um, we're just here again. Alright. Oh, then, um... Let's not go, let's not go over there yet. Let's take a moment to heal up. Now that we're here, why don't we buy um, some potions? All right. Now to go off to the lab. Which is all the way over here. 